Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I will be taking my vitamins and drinking water. Let me sit and then I'll break down the video. Today's video, if you're new, hi. First, my name is Maribel and I'm a personal trainer, as well as a nutritionist and plenty other stuff but for today's video i'm gonna be answering some questions that you guys asked me i put a post on my instagram on my stories i usually answer all of my questions always on my stories but today i said it's vlogmas so why not so let me take my vitamins i got the questions on my phone i'm gonna pull them up honestly i'm going to be honest I get asked about my height and my weight and my measurements almost every single day. I did a story on my Instagram where I answer it. I answer it on my comments on YouTube and I answer it on TikTok. So, for the record, I am 5'6". I weigh 150. Last time I checked, I believe, what was my measurement? I'll put it in the screen because I totally forgot. Hopefully, I saved that story. Oh, Let's get to the questions because if you know me, I'm always in a rush. I'm trying to multitask. I do have my clients, so I train clients. I do Zoom. I do coach. When I tell you one of my favorite things to do is coaching people, talking to them, helping them, guiding them. I didn't know how much I was gonna love it. I love talking to people. If you do wanna try any of my services, feel free to send me a DM or an email. All of my information is always on my Instagram. I added my general plan, that's on my bio. I added my muscle pie store, that's also on my bio, and all of my other social media stuff. So you can feel free to go follow me and go check that out. Now, to the video. So first question that somebody DM me was, what motivates you to work out? What motivates me, honestly, I have a passion for fitness. I love what I do. I really love what I do. God put this in my heart and I'm going to follow it. Eyes closed, heart open. Can I hear your Dominican accent? Que lo que mi pana, tu eres lo mío, tu estas frío conmigo. What are some exercises that target your core? I really believe that your core is work every single day when you work out. If you engage your core throughout your entire workout, you are working on your core. However, if you want to have a selected day that you choose to do abs, that is fine. I recommend you to always do abs with a cardio because ab workout is not going to give you abs. Cardio is going to shred that fat and then your abs will show. Everyone has abs, it's just how much fat percentage do you have. Can you provide a flexibility routine? Yes, I could provide a flexibility routine. One thing that I noticed with my body personally, I might not be focusing on flexing on that day or like on my joints or like my motions, but even with me moving throughout the whole day, my body is lubricated. So I'm able to be more flexible compared to when I'm just in bed and I feel stiff. So again, workout, that's the first step. And then if you wanna add some flexibility routine, perfect. How do you do cardio and strength training to see results? So, personally, my program that I do for myself is I do my heavy lifting at the beginning because I'm trying to work on my strength. So I wanna save all of this energy that I have for my training session. Then after, I'll go ahead and do my cardio session, which is usually the bike or a light walk, anything, just for like 10, 15, 20 minutes. Simple. I will advise you, depending on your goal, next time just tell me, what is your goal? Do you want to build strength? Do you want to build power? Are you trying to shred? Are you trying to bulk? I'm trying to bulk. I always advise not to overdo your cardio. Have set days where you focus on cardio because you want to work on your cardiovascular. Ask your trainer or a professional to find your heart rate where you shred the most. And then once you have that number, you don't have to overdo or overgo above the heart rate. No matter if you do, you will still get the same results. What is the best days to rest and recover? Depending on your fitness program, will be the best day for example and depending again it's all about your goals and what do you want and how's your schedule for example me if i was i'm different i'm a different type of beast because i'm gonna be honest i do little things seven days a week it doesn't have to be a training session 
where I'm going hard every single day. But every single day, I do something active, as simple as taking a walk. So it really depends what you want. What's your favorite way to stay active and maintain a healthy lifestyle? My favorite way to stay active is to go to the gym and work out. What advice will you give to other women looking to prioritize their health and fitness in today? So, one advice that I would give to a woman who's trying to put her health first is start small. Start small. Little things to make yourself feel good. I feel like when I eat clean, when I drink my water, I feel good. I feel like, okay, I did that. I feel good about myself. I would say start small. Make yourself a list of things that you want to do from, hey, I'm going to drink water today. Like, I mean, like, drink the actual amount of water that I need. You should be drinking half your weight. I'm going to have a healthy lunch. I'm going to take a walk today. I'm going to go. I'm going to make sure that I buy things that I is gonna fuel my body so start small and another thing that I would say is don't judge yourself don't put pressure on yourself because when you do all of that all you're really creating is trauma and stress and your body does not work well when neither so as long as your mind is healthy that's a great start also what I'm gonna advise you is to DM me because I'm a personal trainer and I could definitely guide you through any challenges that you might be going through. In terms of nutrition, do you have any favorite healthy recipes? Um, when it comes to nutrition, I'm very careful about what I say online compared to if you was my client. Because if you're my client, I know your goal, I know what you should be doing. Online is tricky. Because people could take what you say and hear it different. And I don't want people to take my words and switch it. What that means is, and it's not and it's not in a bad way, but if I might be saying something, they might just take it the wrong way. So for nutrition, I'm very careful. I don't put a lot of content on nutrition, but I do have a general guide on my bio that you could look at i also do personalized where i measure and i do all the calculations with your atp your ree that's all of your energy levels plus your goals so if you want to maintain if you want to bulk if you want to shred i i got you so now that i answer your guys questions if i didn't answer your question i'm gonna go ahead on my instagram now and answer them on my stories because I got to spread the love and I don't want to be editing an hour video and I think that you don't want to hear me talk either, right? Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for all the love. Thank you for the DM. Appreciate you so much. But now it's my time to ask you guys some questions. So answer below to these questions. Question number one, what is your favorite workout? What is a content that you're looking forward but you're just too shy to say? Now is your time. Write it down below. Let me know what you are waiting for. And my last question is, what are your goals for 2024? Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time. Bye.